the comments made by nitish kumar ji the most despicable disgusting atrocious obnoxious and women virodhi comments that have been made only shows the impact of the influence of rjd from sushasan babu now to bekabu babu this kind of commentary only shows that if they think like this and speak like this in the assembly imagine what is the plight of the women in the state of bihar in the jungle raj that has been created in bihar and in short condemning the statement mamta didi rahul gandhi priyanka wadra akhilesh yadav arvind kejriwal they are all silent so they endorse it tejasvi yadav deputy cm has justified it said it is sex education this shows the very little education he may be having but if he is justifying this comments it only shows the level to which this alliance has fallen and this alliance for them it is common such statements rajasthan has become number 1 in rapes daily some statements are made including a statement by a minister mardo ka pradesh hai dachwa rapes take place and he was given the ticket by congress party mulayam singh yadav ji's party has said boys will be boys in justified rape we have seen abu azmi and azam khan statements also so this is common parlance in the entire india alliance and therefore they are justifying it not condemning it if they indeed condemn it they should tell us what action should be taken nitish kumar ji has no locus moral locus moral authority to continue as chief minister after insulting 50% of the population of the country if he has any integrity he must step down after such a statement this kind of mindset this kind of actions that he has done in the assembly the women of this country will never forgive this alliance the women will never forgive nitish kumar